Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I will be taking you guys along with me throughout my day. I hope I have a lot of casting to show you guys because I'm super excited to be making more videos for you guys. I thank you so much if you are already subscribed. If you haven't yet, make sure to do that right now. And I appreciate you guys so much. Thanks for being here. And let's get straight into the video. Say you wanna cry, but you never do. The weather changing we have a lot of kids getting sick with the flu so just make sure to clean your desk wherever you work at just to make sure you remove all those germs my breakfast for today is this pie it comes with bacon spinach and cheese and of course I also made sure I had some coffee because it will be busy today And our first kiddo of the day is this cast removal. It is a long leg cast and this kid got lucky. They had two colors on their cast. This kid actually had a proximal tibia fracture but thankfully we were able to remove it. Once we removed the cast, the patient actually couldn't go in a boot because the boot doesn't cover all the way up to where the fracture site was. So they were free and were able to walk once they were ready. A few moments later. Up next we have a short arm thumb spica cast and this boy got his thumb jammed while playing football. He unfortunately was complaining that the cast was too tight but I always tell my patients that the cast will always feel a little bit snug and they have to give it a couple of hours even days for it to loosen up a little bit but not to loose where the cast will slide off. And here I removed a long arm cast that has a unicorn on it. Unfortunately, I had to split the unicorn in half to be able to remove the cast properly. I actually applied this cast so I was so happy to see the patient back and remove the cast for them. <laughs> Unfortunately, the little girl did not want to keep her cast, so I threw it in the trash. <laughs> this is one of the most dirtiest thumb spica casts I have ever seen. When I opened it up and took it off the patient, it was just so dirty by the thumb piece and just very stinky. The craziest part is that this patient wanted to keep the cast so I had to remove all the padding and give it back. I know that once the patient gets home they're going to toss this cast away because it is just very stinky. I know for sure that if you are a parent you probably don't want this cast to stink up your whole house. <laughs> And then once we're done taking out all the padding, you just make sure you wrap it around with coband. And this patient actually had to go back into a brace. Thankfully, they can take that off when showering and eating. Don't say you're on the run to the other side, my love. There's this phrase in the healthcare world that if you don't chart it, it wasn't done. So just a reminder to always chart when you're done with the patient. got out for lunch and I actually went to Arby's to buy myself a salad and some chicken nuggets because it honestly has been a good day today but I am excited because I actually get a lunch today so I'm going to eat this up I hope you guys are enjoying this video thank you guys so much for staying and watching I appreciate you guys so much and I think I say that all the time but I really do appreciate you guys so much and I hope you guys know that and thanks again for watching my videos so I ordered a grilled chicken salad it was so delicious you know those moments where you're super hungry and you just want to eat it up well this was one of those moments. I was so hungry and I also got some chicken nuggets and they were delicious. They hit the spot. Try, 
once I was done eating my nutritious chicken nuggets, I removed this long arm cast and this cast was applied on a girl that fell off the monkey bars. So if you have kids, make sure you tell them to stay away from the monkey bars. We just see so many patients during the week that have fallen off the monkey bars and they're just not safe. Sugar, there's a reason why we lose many hours later this last cast that i have here i removed off a three-year-old and this cast was as big as my hand which was so cute so i wanted to share it with you guys i was actually expecting mom to keep the cast but she didn't want it so i ended up throwing it away Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching and make sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my videos. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you in my next video.